And look how that fog is just hovering over the bottom of the track there and how the light comes through in shafts as it peers through the trees there. guys hello and welcome to another race video so we're jumping into automobilista 2 today you guys have been suggesting to me that i jump back in and have another look at it since the more recent updates particularly with regards to some of the weather effects that they've updated more recently so we've dived on to the nordschleife today for a two-lap race and as you can see we're doing early morning here with all sorts of fog effects on the circuit it's going to be transitioning into some light rain towards the end of the race as well. Now, firstly, gotta say a big thank you to Mozza Racing for sponsoring today's video. As you can see, we're running the FSR wheel on the rig right now. If you wanna check them out, links down in the description below. We just reviewed their brand new R3 wheelbase and wheel just the other day, which is Xbox compatible. So check them out via the link down in the description below. So we're gonna be trying to battle our way through the field as far as we can today from the rear of the grid with the AI set to level 100 so a little bit below maximum but maximum aggression I'm not used to driving these P1 cars so it's going to be a bit of a learning experience probably faster than the cars that I'm used to driving around here but just look at how these weather effects are implemented now with this early morning conditions we're running Starting at 6 a.m. for those who might be wondering and wanting to replicate this, well, probably shouldn't want to be, don't want to be in first gear there. But look how that fog is just hovering over the bottom of the track there and how the light comes through in shafts as it peers through the trees there. Let's see if we can sneak down the inside of this guy. Oh! <laughs> I think he's still on my inside. Oh no, we're clear. That's good. All right. Another one there. It's just so immersive with that light, the way it comes through. And I've got the ambient lighting system running as well, which is shining on my hands and the steering wheel brightening that up too. Whoa, nearly lost it. <laughs> it feels like they have improved the physics quite significantly as well. Every time I jump back into Automobilista 2, it always feels significantly better than it did the previous time I had a go of it. Look at that lighting, wow. Oh, <laughs> I'm feeling a little bit anxious about the rain now. <laughs> it's gonna be coming probably towards the second half of lap two, I would say. Thought about a move down the inside there. Oh, back end getting a little loose. That's something I'm used to happening in iRacing around here. Oh, little touch. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> All right. Through the shadows on the back of the mountain. Fog seems to have cleared a little bit in this section as we get on into the morning. How fast do we want to go here? The guys behind are catching up in the slipstream, I think. Carried a good amount of speed there. Oh. All right, coming up to the carousel now. Oh, <laughs> not the best. Okay. Look at those reflections. Try to keep it out of the fence. Oh, that's him done. All right, let's see if we can catch this next group. Carry as much speed as we can. 
Not super confident with how aggressive I can be with the curbs in this car. Something I've always struggled with at Nordschleife. Oh, almost touched the grass. Seems like I can ride the curbs a bit. We're up to 23rd from 28th. Over the jump. All right, now we should be pretty well flat out through this section, I think. Bit of battle going on ahead here. And then we're gonna have to be heavy on the brakes. Probably could have carried a bit more speed there through the second carousel. All right, let's see if we can take advantage of the slipstream now. Even just the way it illuminates the dirt on the windscreen is an improvement. All these little things just add to the immersion. How are we going in our mirrors? Topping out six gear here. Two hundred and eighty five kilometers an hour. We'll touch on the dirt. Oh, I'm seeing some raindrops already. I think it might have been my imagination. Of course, we can't just dive into the pits around Nordschleife, so it's going to be sketchy. It's definitely getting darker now. I got more speed down the straights than I do. I'm not sure what that's all about. Try to hold it flat. <laughs> I carried a bit more speed than he did through there. Get down the inside, baby. Oh, no. Nah. I've got the aggression set to maximum, so they're moving around a bit on me. Whoa. Okay. Down the inside. Definitely some spits of rain now. I see them on the windscreen. We don't quite need our windscreen wipers yet, but it's gonna get close. The way the weather progression runs though, really, really impressive. I'm gonna go full wipers now. Let's see how it impacts the grip levels though. Not feeling a large impact just yet, but We'll see a bit of a sun shower. Okay. All right, yeah, I can feel the back end of the car moving around a bit more now. Whoop. Bit of a nudge there. Look at the way that light shines through the trees though. So immersive. Get down the inside of him, which is gonna turn into the outside. Not, not quite, oh. We'll get him here, maybe. <laughs> oh, it's starting to move around a lot now. Oh. Still on my inside, I think. Oh no, tucked in behind now. Oh, front end's wanting to wash out. <laughs> A 
Now I've never driven around the Nordschleife in real life, so I can't comment on what the grip levels will be like, but I can see the surface of the track trying to get shiny now. They're screaming back past me. Oh, these guys are just screaming past me now. What's going on? <laughs> can't keep up. Oh. I would imagine in real life the grip levels would be pretty atrocious by now. It's still drivable, but it's certainly a handful. Get back through this carousel. I definitely don't have the pace to stay with these guys. Remembering these P1 cars do have quite a bit of downforce, which is definitely helping with the grip, but... Having other cars around me is kind of helping me know how fast I could go, otherwise I'd have no idea where the limits are. We get back down the inside of him. Push him out wide. No, that's <laughs> a back out. Whoa. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, it's really moving around now. She's a handful. Over the jump again. Yeah, the turn in's very sketchy now. You definitely got to give this a go though, this is a lot of fun. Oh, come on. Turn, turn, turn. <laughs> Alright, let's try and stay ahead of him down the straight. I don't know how that's going to go. We haven't crashed at least, although I'm probably jinxing myself. Down the straight again. Two eighty kilometers an hour. I think we're clear behind. A little bit difficult to see in the mirrors. That is crazy, crazy immersive though. I think the AI still needs a little bit of work. It seems much faster in some areas than others, but still a lot of fun. Bring it around. And we survived two laps around the Nordschleifer in the wet <laughs> with slick tires. Hope you enjoyed that, guys. And uh, yeah, let me know what you'd like to see next in the comments down below, and I will see you again very soon thanks to all our channel members and patreons as well for all of your support and uh yeah have a good day see you again soon bye